Hi, welcome to my video. This one is the G640 riser module. Um, assembly tray. This is the part number for it. Um, usually when you receive this computer, we don't plug in this module to the board. Because when we plug it in, sometime moving during the transit, it will damage the pin on the motherboard. So, we usually pack this one separately. What you need to do is, you see this guide rail? You need to slide it in, and then slowly push down. Once the rail, if you see here, you need to follow this, this side. And when you insert it, you just clip on. And that's it. So, show you one more time. This one to release. Take it out. And use this one as the guide. Go to this, this area. Make sure you remove the cap first if you have the cap insert. And just lay it in. Yep. And you're ready to go. So, it will like. Ready to put on the cover. When you buy the CPU for the riser module, make sure you have the same one, matching pair, on the existing system. The one I try with is 4680V3 or 2680-2699V3. They are same. Even though the HP menu doesn't say it support the E54600. And it still works. And thank you for your watching. Hope this helped you to insert your voice module on your Z640 and this one is the PCI NVMe drive this is the model number and thanks